All right. I'm going to try. See if this works. All right. Please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All the meeting to order at 6 p.m. on February 3rd, 2022. Uh, our esteemed town clerk uh, cannot be here this evening due to health reasons. Um, so uh, before we start the meeting, uh, I'd like to receive a motion appointing me as the temporary uh, clerk of the board. Is there a motion? So moved. Is there a second? Second. Ebert. Uh, is there any discussion? Any objection? All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Thank you. Okay. With that said, uh, we'll proceed with roll call. Uh, Michael Cashman present. Thomas Wood. Here. Barbara Heber. Here. Charles Kostek. Here. Anna Isabella. Here. Uh, Catherine Colucci is absent, and James Coffey is absent. Uh, Resolution 37, approve the minutes of the previous meeting. Resolved that the minutes of December 6th and 13th of 2022 be approved, and the reading of the minutes be dispensed with. Is there a motion? So moved. Wood. Is there a second? Second. Austin, is there any discussion? Seeing none. Uh, all, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 So does Carrie. Uh, let's go to, is there anything for public comment this evening? Seeing nothing for public comment, uh, we will proceed. Okay. I know that we need to open a public hearing a little bit, so uh, I'm going to continue to move forward and then open it uh, in a short while. Resolution 38, the abstract, resolved that the abstract to audit the claims of $2,788,589.30. Abstract prepays for $153,059.97 in audit claims. Of $184,862.50 be received and reviewed by the auditing committee and the supervisor is hereby authorized to pay the abstract. Is there a motion? So moved. Wood, is there a second? Second. Ebert, any discussion? Seeing none, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 So does Carrie. Thank you. Resolution 39, uh, request to attend the annual Code Enforcement Educational Conference. Do you want somebody else to read them? Uh, sure, if you want to read one for me, okay. that'd, that'd be great. Thank you. Well, as it is in the best interest of the town code enforcement officers to remain current and informed concerning changes in regulation and participation in the annual conference, will enable the code's authors to earn 24 credits to maintain their license. Therefore, it is resolved that Stephen Einhoff, Alan Reese, and Drew Arthur, code's enforcement officers, be allowed to attend the Northern Adirondack Code Enforcement Official Association's 27th Annual Education Conference held from February 28th March to March 3rd, 2022, in Lake Placid, New York, at the High Peaks Plaza. And it is further resolved that two $1,448 for dues, conference fees, lodging, and meals be charged to the code a zoning budget account and be it further resolved that a copy of this resolution be given to the finance manager and code enforcement officers. Thanks, Tom. Uh, is there a motion? I'll make a motion. Uh, Isabella, thank you. Is there a second? Second. Constant. Any discussion? Seeing none. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Resolution carries. Uh, resolution 40, Senior Account Clerk Typist Position Promotion, Barbara Miner. Whereas in February 2017, Barbara Miner was hired as an account clerk typist in the Water and Wastewater Department, and whereas Barbara Miner deals with more complex clerical work and supervises billing tasks of new hires, hirees, clerk typists, and whereas Mrs. Miner has 
pass the senior account clerk, type this civil service exam is reachable from the current civil service listing. Therefore, it be resolved that this motion will take effect on February 7, 2022, with a 12-week probationary period. This places Barbara Minor at code at grade six, step one, at an hourly rate of $23.70. It is further resolved that the supervisor is hereby authorized to sign all necessary documents to promote Barbara Minor to the position of senior account clerk typist. Be it further resolved that a certified copy of this resolution be given to the finance manager to be placed in Mrs. Minor's personnel file. Thank you. Is there a motion? So moved. Ebert, is there a second? Second. Austin, any discussion? Seeing none. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 So does Carrie. At this time, we're going to proceed with uh, opening of a public hearing. This meet, uh, the Town of Plattsburgh Town Board monthly meeting public hearing, February 3rd, 2022. The meeting was called to order at 6 p.m. by the presiding officer of the town, uh, town Hall on the Bank Road. Further notice is hereby given that the Town Board of the Town of Plattsburgh will meet and hold public hearing thereon to at the Town Hall located at the Bank Road in the Town of Plattsburgh, Clinton County, New York, on Thursday, February 3rd at 6.05 p.m. prevailing time in relation to the proposed uh, amendment to the zoning ordinance, smart growth plan, lead aid, uh, lead edging, and seeker review. Uh, at this time, we would accept written comments into the record and also open to the floor for an open public hearing uh, for comment. Is there a motion uh, to open the public hearing? So moved. Wood, is there a second? Second. Costick. Uh, I get a roll call. Thomas Wood. Yes. Barbara Hebert. Yes. Charles Costick. Yes. Dana Isabella. Yes. Michael Cashman. Yes. We will officially open the public hearing at 6.06 .06 p.m. Uh, is there anyone seeking to provide written comments to the record of this public hearing or anyone seeking to come forward to provide uh, comments from the floor? Seeing no one at the moment and having not received anything uh, to date for written comment, uh, we will proceed with the agenda uh, over the next couple of resolutions just to provide uh, some additional opportunity to appear. So we'll move back uh, to the regular agenda. Resolution 41, 3% site plan, return deposit for Wilson Holding Site Plan 2020. Whereas the Town of Plattsburgh Planning Board has reviewed and approved all requirements of the Wilson Holding <coughs> Site Plan 2020, and whereas the Planning and Community Development Department has coordinated inspection and set project and reports all requirements have been met and completed. Therefore, it be resolved that the supervisor is here, hereby authorized and directed to release the deposit in the amount of $960.28 plus accrued interest to date. It is further resolved that a certified copy of this resolution be forwarded to the Planning and Community Development Department Secretary with a return of deposit to N. Wilson Holdings, LLC. Is there a motion? So moved. Costic. Is there a second? Second. Would. Any discussion? Seeing none. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 So does Carrie. Thank you. Proceed to resolution 42, change order number one, contract number four, electrical water supply improvements. First, the town of Plattsburgh's water and wastewater department went out to bid and rewarded the water supply improvements <coughs> contract number four, electrical. Uh, resolution number 20, uh, 21-126, as part of uh, an ongoing capital improvement plan, and whereas the electrical service can be reduced from 800 amps to 600 amps, as well as reducing the generator size from 750 kilowatts to 250 kilowatts. And whereas based on based the time to receive the generator and transfer switch, the contractor has requested a time extension to September 30th, 2022. And whereas Triangle Electric Services Systems Incorporated has submitted a pricing adjustment resulting in a credit for the service reduction of $3,500 and a generator credit of $161,496 for a total credit of $164,846. Now, therefore, it be resolved that the town board does hereby authorize the supervisor to execute said change order to number one, change order number one, contract number four. It be further resolved that a copy of this resolution be given to the finance manager and water and wastewater director the Bridge Engineering and Triangle Electrical Services Incorporated. Thank you, Tom. Is there a motion? So moved. Ebert, is there a second? Second. Isabella, uh, any discussion? Oh, I just want to thank Scott Stoddard for being available to this 
discuss the resolution. Usually a change order means an increase in cost, but this is an increase in Correct. credit. So. All right, at this time, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 Uh, so does Carrie. Resolution 43, appointment of Nic Nicholas Willard as laborer in building and grounds department. Whereas the vacancy exists in the position of maintenance worker in the building and grounds department that was duly posted, and whereas interviews for the aforementioned position were held by the members of the town board and superintendent of the buildings and grounds, and whereas upon completion of interviews, the committee's recommendation is that the town board consider Nicholas Willard for the existing vacant buildings and grounds position, and whereas all employment verification eligibility has been satisfied, now ther therefore be resolved that the town board does hereby authorize the hiring of Nicholas Willard the position of laborer as of February 7, 2022, with a pay rate as per contract of $19.44, and it is further resolved that this appointment become effective following final civil service approval and that the supervisor is hereby authorized to sign all necessary documents for the full-time appointment of Nicholas Willard, the position of laborer in the Buildings and Grounds Department with a probation period of one year. It is further resolved that a certified copy of this resolution be given to the finance manager, superintendent of building and grounds. And it should also say uh, to Nicholas Willard yeah, as well. Say to Nicholas. Uh, is there a motion? So Caustic. Is there a second? Second. Is it done? Any discussion? Seeing none. Uh, because this is a new hire, I'm going to ask for a roll call. Uh, Thomas Wood. Yes. Barbara Hebert? Yes. Charles Comstock? Yes. Dana Isabella? Yes. Michael Cashman? Yes. Resolution does carry. Uh, resolution 44 updated, updated wage and salary administration program to reflect part time employees. Whereas Public Sector HR Consultants LLC was retained in 2019 to conduct a comprehensive study and produce a wage and salary administration program for non represented posi positions in the town of Plattsburgh. And whereas the town of Plattsburgh chose to update this program for part-time, non-represented positions, and has received the updated wage and salary administration manual from Public Sector HR Consultants, LLC. And whereas the information con contained in the manual has been prepared to describe the town of Plattsburgh wage and salary administration program, statements contained in the manual are meant as guidelines to be utilized by the town board in making wage and salary decisions. Policies contained herein may be modified at any time by the town board in its sole discretion. And further, and further resolved, the town board does hereby adopt the wage and salary administration manual with particular focus on the wage and salary structure fully described in section six to serve as a guide for wage and salary decisions, which provides one of the basic controls of the, pro, of, of the grade levels and pay ranges within each level have been developed to fit the town of Plattsburgh's specific needs. Uh, is there a motion? So, Tostic, is there a second? Second. Hebert, any discussion? Mm -hmm. uh, a roll call? Yeah, roll call, please. Uh, Mr. Wood? Yes. Uh, Hebert? Yes. Tostic? Yes. Isabella? Yes. Cashman? Yes. Resolution uh, does carry. Uh, I'm going to go back to the public hearing because we only have one resolution after this. Uh, at this point, uh, I would make a last call. Is there anyone seeking to provide written uh, comments into the record for this public hearing, or is anyone seeking to come uh, before the board and comment from the floor for this public hearing? So is anyone seeking to provide written comment or to come before the board uh, to provide public comment? Is anybody seeking to provide written comment or, for, or to step forward and come before the board uh, to speak from the floor? Seeing no one in front of us and having no written comment provided, uh, I would seek a motion to officially close this public hearing. Is there a motion? Mr. Wood, is there a second? Second. Councilor Steven. <coughs> uh, roll call. Wood? Yes. Hebert? Yes. Costick? Yes. Isabella? Yes. Cashman? Yes. We will officially close this public uh, hearing at 6.14 p.m. Moving on to the last resolution, Resolution 45, Amend Emergency Dog Control Services. Right, Resolution 21, two, uh, 2010, was, 2010, no, <laughs> excuse me, 21 to 10, 
was passed for a temporary dog control officer with a term that has now expired. Whereas Jody Pereira is licensed DCO and is willing to continue to furnish emergency dog control services to the town as in the attached agreement as an independent contractor on an as needed or emergency basis. And now therefore resolved that the town's attorney review the su review after the town uh, attorney's review, the supervisor enter into the attached agreement between the town of Plattsburgh, a municipal corporation existing pursuant to the laws of the state of New York, having its principal office and place of business at 151 Banker Road, Plattsburgh, Clinton County, New York, here and after the town, and Jody Pereira, here and after the contractor. To be further resolved that a copy of this resolution be given to the town clerk and finance manager. And should one go to also yeah. Jody Pereira? Yeah. Uh, is there a motion? So moved. Uh, Ebert, is there a second? Second. Woods, any discussion? Uh, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 Carry. Thank you very much, folks. Uh, before we end, uh, I know we say it a lot, but you know, given the fact that there's a major storm there, uh, I just want to give uh, some kudos and appreciation to our highway department. Uh, you know, I have long said that, uh, you know, living in the North Country, we are in the winter business, and we have some of the best professionals out there, uh, so uh, much thanks to them, and I also want to give um, uh, my deepest appreciation to the water department as well, um, because, you know, pipes freeze and, and, and burst and things like that, and our guys are out there uh, in, the, you know, the bitter cold, you know, the wind, the snow, um, so just, um, we've got a great team where we're all, but just want to give a special shout out to those two teams uh, as we stand here. So drive safe, be well, and at this point, uh, I know of no reason to go into an executive session, so I would accept the motion to adjourn tonight's meeting. Is there a motion? So no moved. Bostic, uh, Isabella, uh, any discussion? Seeing none, all those, in, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 We will adjourn officially at 6.16 p.m. Uh, drive safe at one. So Barb, are we 9.30 is still going?